Hello everybody and welcome to 444, the Face for Wrestling Premier Interviews. Premier interview show where we take our favorite wrestlers and we ask them the questions that you didn't know you wanted to know. Today, we are joined by a very special guest. We have the Renegade Twins in the house. What's Hi. up guys? Hey, how are you Charlotte doing, and Robin, the, the Renegade, Renegade Twins. <laughs> That's right, guys. We have the champ champs in the house, the Mission Pro Wrestling and CCW Tag Team Champions of the World are here with us today. I like it. Oh, my God. And they're going to become your favorite wrestlers as we ask them four questions and get their top four of those four questions. It sounds a little more complicated than it is, but y'all got me? Y'all know what we're doing here? I believe so. Pretty sure. And the secret is they don't know what these questions are going to be. Yeah, I'm actually really Correct. nervous. He's been teasing me all day yeah. about these questions. That's true. And we're going to start with today's episode. This is going to be a two-parter. We're going to split y'all up a little bit. Y'all can stay together, and you can even answer her questions. But you are getting separate questions. And in part one, we're going to start with Charlotte. Are you ready <laughs> to do this? Yes. We're going to start off easy. Okay. I want to know your top four favorite Disney villains. Oh. That's a good question. Ooh. Love like that. But now I gotta think. My top four favorite Disney villains. Oh my gosh. No particular order. I like Ursula, because the Little Mermaid. That's like classic. Yeah. Um, I really like Hades from Hercules. Underrated. Underrated for sure, yeah. yeah. Um I really like Mulan, but I really don't like the villain in that movie. The, I feel the, like so put on the spot and I'm just trying to think of like all of the things. Um I like Tefiti and Moana. Okay. Because even though she's painted as a villain, she's really not a villain. It was the first big like tragic villain in Disney. Yes. Yeah. I really enjoyed her. And then let me pick one more. Jafar. Because why not? He's solid. Yes, he's he's pretty Cartoon solid. Cartoon or live action? Cartoon. I don't Cartoon. really like the live action movie. Ooh. My bad. Unpopular we're, we're getting opinion. The drama. We're getting the drama. Unpopular opinion. My bad. <laughs> Robin, do you want to throw in a Disney villain? Did she forget one? Man, I don't know. That's so hard because when you said that, I was like, oof, that's really good. <laughs> that's a really good question. I don't know if you guys watch Hamilton, Aaron Burr. In Count, that, good. I Disney will Plus. take Jafar yeah. off of that. Yep. Counts. So fast. Yeah. To be Aaron Burr. I will say, though, you did leave out the worst, or the best, or worst, depending on how you look at it, Disney villain, with the best Disney villain song, Scar from The Lion King. You're right. That was the correct answer. I got to give Scar his props. Prepared. Yeah, no, man, there's too many. So like, I'll take Tefiti off and put, I'm taking Tefiti and I'm uh, taking Jafar off and I'm replacing them with Aaron Burr from Hamilton mm -hmm. and Scar. Scar. From and Scar. He's pretty, pretty legit. Okay. So you asked my my Disney villain that I would throw in. Mm -hmm. Shelt's gonna laugh at this. I would say Abuela. I would. That was the first thing that popped in my brain too. <laughs> the reason I say that is because she really came at all of her family members for no reason at all, just she no said, reason. Oops. And she was the reason the miracle was just died. <laughs> and she, you know, she was that really big undercover villain, and I could really, I could dig That's it. Fair. That's fair. You know fair. what I mean? All right. We're moving on to round two. Yes. Are you ready? And now you know so. that there's a correct answer. So like, yeah, I didn't know there was a correct answer. answer. There is a possibility a of the correct answer. Are you ready? This one's probably going to be a kind of a staple. So this one's going to be even easier. Top favorite four workout songs. Okay. So right now, pressure by Ari Lennox. When I'm running and doing cardio, it helps me keep a pace. It's really bouncy. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh wow. I listen to a lot of Chris Brown, anything Chris Brown. I listen to a lot of Tupac, a lot of like hard music. Mm -hmm. Same. I would say some of my Tupac songs, but the lyrics, I like the I names you. of the songs just aren't very, or are not very appropriate. We'll just go with Tupac in general. If yes, Tupac, Tupac song, in general, um, Chris Brown in general, but specifically Ari Lennox, Pressure, that's a really good one. And then of course, anything from Hamilton. I get yeah. down pretty hard too. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah. Cool, cool. All right, from there, no, the right, the correct answer was anything by Disturbed, 
Ooh, uh, uh, uh. Wait a That's minute. That's all you Wait need. A Ooh, uh, 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 Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Who the hell is disturbed? See, now we're going to have to change into a React channel and have y'all watch Disturbed <laughs> videos all day. Um, y'all didn't know that was going to happen. Uh, 90s new metal. That's all you need. Just, ooh, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh. They're going to yell at you. It's great. It's phenomenal. It makes you ooh, run. Ooh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. You want to Ting Tang, Wawa, Bing Bang. Like... That's a different song. <laughs> but I do know that one. That's Did Alvin and Chipmunks. Funny it... one? I run to uh, DuckTales, the moon theme. I don't even know. The one in the video game? I don't remember yeah, that look one. that up. It's funny. Gotcha. It's, it's nice and bouncy. <laughs> All right, next. As y'all seen in the studio here, we're a bunch of big nerds, so we're going to go with a nerd question. Okay. Can you do nerd? I can try my best. Right. Here we go. <laughs> Top four mythological creatures. Oh, that's a good That question. is a really good question. I'm looking at the Dr. White. Dr. D. White. Mm. My bad. I'm Off in the corners. <laughs> um, let me get the question one more time. Top four mythological creatures. I already have all of my four. I'm so upset. What's the one? Why that couldn't you just ask me this question? <laughs> Minotaurs. Minotaurs is cool. Yeah. Um, what's the one where you cut its head off? The Hydra. Medusa. The Hydra. <laughs> the Hydra. Medusa. Medusa not up there for me. Um, Cerberus. Mm-hmm. Dog gates yes. of hell. Yeah. Yes. Um, um, a griffin, right? Is that a, a griffin? Is a mythological a creature? Mythological creature? Yes. Yeah. Those are my three. Uh, They're pretty four. 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 She said this. She got four. Minotaur. Four for four. Cerebus, uh, Hydra. Hydra, and Griffin. Yeah. And they're all pretty gotcha. strong. I'll let creatures. you since you have yours. I'll let you throw yours out there real quick oh. too. So the first thing I'll only throw one out there, and yeah. this is gonna pop a lot of people. But the first thing that popped in my mind was a pork from Star Wars. <laughs> I think that they're the cutest things ever. <laughs> I love them. Does that count as mythological? Are they're not real. About, they're like, a myth. Greek? Yeah, they're a myth. They're a myth. It doesn't have to be Greek. It can be any mythology. Any like unicorns? We do not discriminate. Like <laughs> so we got one last category for you. Okay. And this one, I feel like the fans would probably be mad if I didn't ask you a wrestling question. So I'm going to ask you to name your top four favorite arm bars. You can do it just by number. Just One, by number. two, three, and four. There we go. There you go. <laughs> I'm, I'm partial to arm bar number 26, uh, but that's just me. But one, two, three, and four are all really good answers. Yeah, uh, if I had to pick different numbers, I'd go one, eight, nine, and 18. 18. And that's the beauty, my numbers. The beauty of this is, this is eight, this is eight, this is also eight. <laughs> this is nine. Ten and, and sixteen. Ten. ten and sixteen, yes. Ten, sixteen. We're gonna show all those variants on the screen yes. right now. Because we love Waldo here. Boom, boom. And boom. he can make this happen. Because <laughs> Waldo is, is the, the man. Goat. If he, he doesn't keep goat. that in there, sure. he's really not the man. <laughs> Again, like I'm cutting it out. <laughs> and I know I said it was four for four, and we were only going to ask you four questions of your top four. This is your first time I ever doing this, and you're going to destroy the name I had of a the special first request. show? I had a special request. Okay, what's the special request? And I'm not going to tell you who gave me this request, but I think y'all will be able to figure it out. Who are your top four favorite Rena kids? <laughs> There's only one. And, <laughs> and it's she... Little Miss... <laughs> yes. Yes. We love her to death. That was great answers to all of those questions. <laughs> We want to thank, again, the Renegade Twins for being here today. Thank you for having us. And we're looking forward to see you on March 5th yes. in Conroe, Texas. Yes, sir. At the Southern, Southern Star, Star Brewing, Brewing Company, Company, where we will see you defend your tag team titles against Maddie and Roche, Bougie Reality. You guys can watch that live in person. Show up at the brewery, meet the Renegade Twins, buy some po posters, buy some shirts, get some autographs, or you can watch that on TitleMatchNetwork.com sir anything you guys want to say to end yeah. our show no sweet meats yes no <laughs> sweet meats also get you some get you some y'all let's go <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Okay, yeah my twitter <laughs> instagram go follow me on twitter at char renegade underscore one on instagram it's at charlette dot renegade C-H-A-R-L-E-T-T-E. -T -T -E. Um, I'm pretty sure that my Twitter is Robin W underscore 18. 
Um, and then I'm pretty sure that my Instagram is robin.renegade. Don't quote me on that, guys. See you there. <laughs> oh, follow the Renegade Twins. Instagram, at renegade.twins. Twitter, at renegade underscore twins. Peace. Now we'll see you there. We'll have all those <laughs> links down below. Make sure and check us out. Like us, subscribe us, do all that stuff you're supposed to do. Thank you very much.